Hey everyone, welcome to another YouTube video. Today I'm going to be doing a review of the new Nike Vapormax Mock Flyknit trainers. And the reason I wanted to do this is because I've been looking at purchasing the trainers for a while and I couldn't never find I couldn't find any reviews of girls, women, ladies that have bought the trainers. So I could only really watch reviews of guys that have bought the trainers, so it's hard to really see how it would look on a girl. But then I finally went ahead and purchased them anyway, so I thought I'd make a video of how they look and how they feel so hopefully if you are looking into buying these trainers or if you're just looking into buying a new pair of trainers then maybe this will be helpful to you so i really hope you enjoyed this video please don't forget to like comment share and subscribe and i'll hopefully see you in the next one so i literally just received the box an hour ago and so i thought I'd unbox it so um i've obviously opened the main box and then the box of the trainers looks like this so it's got like the holographic it's like a fancy box for the Vapor Max. And once you open the trainers, you, the box, you've got the um, Vapormax paper in. Mines are in a size 4.5 and I have them in the all black. So these are called triple black. I feel like these shoes are love or hate. So please comment below what you think. For me, when I first saw these, I literally loved the trainers. I just thought this would be like my perfect shoe, especially for every day, which is why I got the all black. But I know they do come in a lot of different colors. Um, but yeah, I just thought for my style, the all black would be best. Um, so yeah, these are the trainers. I hope you can see them well. And you can see these trainers have the bubbles and I think that's what makes people either love or hate the shoe, but I did really like them. And I have tried them on already and I do find them very comfortable. And they add a slight height, which I always look for because I'm quite short. So I like that it adds just a little bit of height so it's not completely flat on the floor. So I'll do a try on and you'll be able to see how they look on foot. Also to mention the price, they were quite expensive, which is why it did take me quite some time to figure out if I did want to buy these. Also, don't forget, if you are a student, you do get 10% off of Nike. And this... Um, specific colorway, they're all black. They released on, on the 24th of November. So I'll just try these on so you can get a feel for how they look on the foot. So that's what the trainers look like once you wear them. I have to say I do really, really love these and they are very comfortable. So that's what the trainers look like on. And so yeah, I think it's worth mentioning. There's the original Nike Vapor Max which do have the laces and these are the Vapor Max Mock. So they're laceless, which I really like because you can literally just put them on and that's why I thought it'd be good for every day. But also I, I like the design of it and I think it looks quite nice and like futuristic without the shoelaces. And in terms of sizing, I would say these are probably true to size and I've also heard that they do kind of stretch out. So if you do buy some that are too tight, I wouldn't worry too much because apparently the fly knit material does loosen up and so do these air bubbles eventually. So. It wouldn't be too big of a deal if they were, did fit a little too tight. So let me know what you think of the trainers. Do you love them? Do you hate them? Um, do you like the colours but hate the shoe? Do you love the shoe but hate the colour? Um, yeah, because I know you can get these in a lot of different colourways. So, yeah, that's my review of these shoes. I will try and video whilst I am outside walking about today to give a true feel of how they look on when outside. So far, I have to say that these are so comfortable and I feel like I'm, I feel like you're bouncing on the air. I love them. In terms of durability also, they seem very, very sturdy. You can tell they're definitely comfortable, but they're very sturdy. It's not very movable. So that's my review on the trainers. I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you found it somewhat useful or um, enjoyable to watch at least. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to comment what you think of the trainers. I would be curious to know if you do love them or hate them. Because um, I think they are a love or hate trainers, but I don't know what anybody else thinks. So it'll be interesting to know. Please don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video.